In this video, we're going to see how to order albums from h, &H Color Lab in EasySuite. In EasySuite, make sure you're on the Catalog tab and come down to Albums. We're going to specifically look at the Gallery Layflat albums. The ordering procedure is similar for all the other album types. Under the Gallery Layflat albums, you'll find our acrylic color cover, eclectic fashion cover, leather cover, metal cover, and photo cover. We're going to order a photo cover for this example. Under our photo cover, we have two options, canvas or glossy or velvet touch. We're going to go with a canvas option. When you choose the photo cover, you're going to have a prompt that lets you know you should re review your trim and safety in EasySuite after you've added all the pages to the um, album. In EasySuite, for any album, an easy way to get started is to use the Guide Me wizard under the album type that you want to order. The Guide Me wizard is going to step us through all the options for that album. The first is the paper types that are available. And we can see all the different paper types that are available for this album, both photographic and press. We're going to choose a linen paper type for this example. We'll step to the next section, and we can choose the page weight. This is uh, single weight or double weight. For this example, again, we're going to go with single weight. Our next option is the end sheet material. That's what we're seeing here on, uh, displayed. The moray black is what you see on the front. The paper flat black is the second one. I'm going to go with flat black for this option. Fourth is our cover, cover material, if applicable. If you're choosing one of the leather albums, this is where you would choose your cover color options. Because we're doing a photo cover and we're doing canvas, there are no options available. Next is the size options. And for this album, we're going to go with a square 10 by 10 album. We'll click the Finish. That's going to return us back to the Catalog Workspace screen. Pay attention, all of the options now have been set over here on the left side. We can override those at any time and change those options if we want to go to our moray end sheet instead of the flat paper. For this example, I have already sequentially named all of the album pages, starting with the cover being a 0, 0, my first spread, which is going to be my left and right sides, is named as 0, 1, all the way down through the end as 10. I'm doing a two-digit padding to make sure that the sequence stays correct. This allows me to select the photo cover here in the workspace, click on the plus, and choose Add All Images to the Layout. And it will automatically flow all those images in in the correct sequence. I can scroll through here and verify that everything is correct. If you've designed your album instead as individual sides, the Add All Images to Layout works just the same. Again, remember to zero pad your or image numbers. You can also add your layouts to the album by just dragging and dropping them into the appropriate openings. If your layouts have been designed as a pano, it's automatically going to split that between the left and right side. You don't have to drag it in twice. Very quick and easy to do as well. Once I've verified that, reviewed my ordering information on the catalog tab, I'll press Add to Order, click on the Order tab, and review everything, and then press Finalize Order to submit to H&H for printing.